Hey guys, welcome back to Meet You Maker. This is going to be episode 5, and today we're just going to be doing some random uh, brutal dungeons and see what we can find, if we can complete them or not. I hope that you guys enjoy. Alright, guys, we're going to be starting out with Cedar Vale, brutal champion one. This one actually doesn't look too bad. They spent time being artistic with it and whatnot. Alright, grab the ball of Forsaken things, and now heading on in. Yeah, I like the looks of this. This looks pretty cool. Little concerned that there's no traps yet, but oh, I thought those were gonna disappear. boy. Well, <laughs> one way to find out. Ah, uh, can't hang on any longer. But. If I go back up there again, I think I can probably just take out that one and this one, then I should be fine, besides that one over there. So there's three I'm going to have to take out. Actually, if I stand right there, I should be fine. Yeah. That's a lot better. Cross ones. That about got me. So I'm just gonna go ahead and make this one activate. Oh, that. That was not where I thought that was. <laughs> That should have done it. Should be able to just walk out now. Kinda. Got a nervous to move. <laughs> ah, I forgot that up there too. This is a cool little base though. I like the idea. Definitely gonna have to be cautious trying to leave here too, because these cubes are gonna block the vision and he's probably got traps hidden behind stuff. Oh, he's got a long one right there. Ooh, he's got tracker darts. That that makes it a little bit more complicated right there. Thought I got that. Just so many traps everywhere. <laughs> Oh, 
bombs. Oh, bombs. <laughs> Got the tunnels. Oh, that's a little bit of an issue because I don't have any of my darts. Hey guys, it's editing DJ here. And I just want to take a moment while focused. DJ isn't really talking and running through this horrendous dungeon, and say happy Easter to everybody. And also, if you're still watching by now, why not hit the uh, subscribe button and hit like? It lets me know that you guys are enjoying the content. But that's all from me editing DJ. I want to let you guys back to watch and focus DJ. <laughs> Later, guys. Sorry for being all quiet right there. Kinda forgot that I was recording and stuff. But I think that's everything that's actually in the here. So I should be good to go. But man, this thing was brutal. Uh, what's the normal number of attempts that you guys take on a, a base before you just decide to quit? Cause I think I died like 10 times in here. We'll find out here in a moment, but yeah, this one, this one was crazy. I feel like one of these floors. I'm just wary on everything now. There's gotta be something else. Yeah, those ones probably had trackers on it. Yeah, I think that was everything. But that one was crazy. I liked it, but man, for sure getting the brutal and ingenious on that. I think I've run that so many times I can actually probably recreate that dungeon. But I'm not going to, I'm gonna make my own. But yeah, ten times. <laughs> that one was crazy. Alright. On to the next one. Alright guys, I think that we're gonna do this one. This one's made by Cookie the Pug. It actually looks pretty cool, so let's see how it is. Alright, here we are guys. This actually looks really cool, I like this. Uh oh! Did not see you, buddy. Alright, so I found one, but... Oi! But <laughs> the other two are a trap behind walls, so I'm assuming that he has them either blocked off or in his base someplace. Oh, there's a lot of guys in here. I'll try something. Oh, one. Oh, yep, yeah, a lot, a lot. 
might have to swap to my bow after this. Maybe. I know how bad it is. That wasn't too bad. Uh, I feel like some of these walls or something. I don't know if you can change the texture of the walls. I don't think that you can for the ones that disappear. Oh, he's got more. I really don't want to have to use one of my darts right here. And I'm just going to use a nade. For phase two, probably. Too bad yet. Not like that last one. That last one was just insane. Oh, there we go. This gave me a bit. I thought he was fully armored. He may have been. Yeah, I want the big guys first. I can actually shoot them. The other ones I can sword if I need to. You know what? I'm just gonna toss a nade up there. Man, there's a lot of them. Definitely need my uh, crossbow if I die here. This one step at a time. <laughs> got him. Let him shoot. We got him. Here we go. Wasn't too bad right there. I just don't know where my other dart went. Go ahead and take that out so I don't forget about it. I really need to buy the perk so I can see it from 20 meters away. Oh, there it is. Alright. Let's see what else this guy has to offer. It's been pretty intense so far. Traps are cool and all, but I really like fighting the guys more because I feel like it's more of a consistent thing. The traps, it's like, a, oh hey, it's done. For most of them, anyways, like the darts because it's the cheapest one to build with, so. Oh, this guy's got some long tunnels. Aw, uh, I have a feeling right when I activate this, these tunnels are gonna be filled with guys. Calling it right here.
maybe not. Oh, I thought there was one right there. <laughs> I still feel like he's gonna have something crazy though. He's gonna have something like those walls that I've seen, I guarantee there's gonna be something that comes up out of those. Or something, I don't know yet. But... You should have put some traps up on the top because I didn't even think about looking up. Let's try to see if there's any more. guys or anything. But yeah, he, he chopped in the other ones. I can hear it right below. There's gotta be something out here. We ain't done yet. Oh. We're done. Okay. That one... I think that was a no death. That was pretty good. But... Alright guys, that's probably going to be the end of this episode because that first one was a little bit longer and I'm going to have to edit out a lot of deaths and stuff. So if you guys enjoyed, please hit that like and subscribe button. That lets me know that you guys are enjoying the content and I'll see you guys next time.